What's up everybody, welcome back to another drawing tutorial, soccer player today, Neymar Jr. So, landscape page, pencil eraser for these semi-realistic sort of portraits, so take your time, sketch it out lightly. Head is kind of over to the left, right? So we'll get his nose sort of in the right place. So we'll carve it around. That's the bridge of his nose, right? So his eye will be along, the eyes will be along this line. And then the nose will curve down around the tip, like so. And this will sort of just go down into his skin, just down here. His nostril then above. And you can sort of thicken this up just in the corner, just make it look a little bit darker. His nostril then will come around the skin for it, come around the back, curve up into here. And then you could have, you know, light sort of hatching lines and then some skin lines to come out the side of his face for his cheek, just sort of down here. So his eye again is across from this, right? So it's a bit of a distance, right? So it's about here in line with the inside of his nostril, right? So vertically, your nostrils and your eyes sort of line up, right? So on the inside there. So We'll go with top eyelid first. So we'll go diagonal and then down. Like so. Now he does have eyelashes, right? So we'll just add some that stick up this way. Just coming around his eye and they kind of disappear then underneath his the skin of his eyelids there. So his actual eyeball curves there and then we have his tear duct sort of just in the corner so say like going that way and then back up there's all skin here that you can't really see and then like the bags underneath his eyes start there so that's his tear duct on the edge of his eye and then his bottom eyelid line just comes around here comes up into the corner of the eye that way and he could have some dark eyelash lines just here okay his iris and pupil he's looking to the left right so it's kind of an ellipse sort of shape so it curves down Kind of pointy along the bottom and then back up here so dark sort of top line and there's another sort of eyelid line that comes down this way across the eye and then this eyelid line kind of comes out the top across here Okay, so then his pupil again will be a, th a thin circle, elliptical sort of circle here. Color it black, right? So that makes him look like he's looking that way. So his eyebrow, just above. So it can kind of be hairy as you start and then they kind of go back this way. And they're arched over his eye, down there, and real hairy at the top. Down like so. Some light lines just for the temple of his head, like so. And some more sort of nose lines and things just coming out this way 
He's got like a bag underneath his eyes. And his cheek sort of goes that way. His cheekbone. And then another line for the inside of his nose here. Just sort of light lines around the nose just to sort of suggest some shape to it. Okay, so the other side of his head, right? So we got like the eyebrow kind of like sticks out a little bit here. You can just see like the hair of it just going around the side of his head, right? And this will be his forehead then with some kind of frowning lines. Just coming around his forehead there. And then his forehead starts to go back up. And then we can see like a little bit of his eye, like a tiny little bit. Just in there, and the skin of his eyelid, like so. And there will be some like eyelashes maybe sticking off here as well. And he'll need some eyelash lines coming along here as well. Some bottom eyelashes, dots and dashes, just going. Like that. Okay, so that's like his, so his cheekbone is like here. So let's say like just a little line going that way. So we'll go down and do his mouth, right? So his top lip comes out here and then it steps in like that. His bottom lip, his top lip, sorry, goes around here, down to the back. There's a bit of a downturn, kind of like shadow there. So top lip then, let's say spikes up and down. And sort of goes up around his mouth that way. And then you can just see like that sort of area of the lip. There. Bottom lip then curves around like this. Comes up into the corner of his mouth. And then just to make his mouth look like it's kind of semi-open, we'll add a shadow just in here. And then his bottom lip keeps going down towards his chin. Chin kind of curves out this way. Could have like a shadow underneath his bottom lip here. And then the chin keeps coming around here. It's quite dark in this lip now. So the jaw keeps going like so. And then comes up towards his ear. And 
just line down the mouth. And he has some facial hair and stuff, but we'll just, we'll get the structure of his forehead. So we'll go up around for his forehead. Just back that way. Like so, some more sort of headlines maybe just going like across here. So then his hairline just comes like a zigzag sort of thing. Just across his head. Like so. And then his shaved side of his head, so this all goes down that way. And he's got like shaved side of the head here and his sideburn comes down and joins the beard, right? So this is all textured beard line. Sort of stubble coming down here and it's on his chin as well. So it's like coming across his top lip. It's not a full beard. Sometimes he has a full beard, but. This just seems to be stubble in this instance. So we just build this up. This will eventually come in behind his ear. So it's like he's really shaved on the side of his ear. And then down towards his jaw. And you're just building it up. So I'll just speed through this now. Right? And then his ear will come out here. So it curves around pretty big. Ear kind of lines up. On this, when his because his head is tilted, so it's like it's his eyebrow and his nostril, so that's the space that your ear sort of lines up with, right? Coming around like so. And the skin of his ear just kind of goes in there, and then we have ear lines inside. that way Look up around here and some shadow maybe. Okay, so, so this is all shaved head in here, so real, this is beard, all shaved head. So like his hair, right? So you got like this shaved kind of section, right? And a long section where they meet. So this like sort of hairy line just goes down that way and then he's got this mohawk thing right so and depending on how long you want to do it but it's very curly so it kind of just bumps around here And this will have like texture lines on it and stuff. That kind of a thing, right? And then this comes down Mohawk style down the back of his neck. 
Nice. It's very shaved. Head there. Nice. So. looks like him so back of his neck then is like completely shaved down here right you could have like some trace of the shaved part of his hair there's all tattoos and stuff down here so then his collar Brazilian collar in this picture goes that way and the shoulder line comes across here bumping down like so and we have a blue or like a screeny blue section this way there and then the green here and then more bumps and folds on his collar just going down like that and we can just see his neck like his adam's apple there and then we have like neck muscle just going that way and some skin folds just coming around the neck here now his tattoos so I need a clearer picture tattoos one second because i can't see nice. well we can see the birds here anyway okay there is birds now, these are done black ink and they're like they look gray but we'll just like do them black simple enough sort of shapes and stuff Just see the bottom of this one here and then there's like big wings coming in there feathers with a cross it looks like going up the back down here more feathers maybe right and there seems to be some lighting on the neck but it's it's very there's like some calligraphy writing but I don't I can't really see it if you want to add that, well, S S A. It's up there. I'll put some here. See, it kind of like folds around his skin, so.
There's more up here. But I can't really see that. Oh, hmm. Just trying to figure that out. So, oh, there's an O there, right? And there's a D here. That's real floral. Where are you? And then what looks like a T, but like an elaborate T. J or T? Not sure. Right, so maybe some or stubble just on his neck. But I think that's the best I can do for his tattoos now. It's the best I can do. So he's got some folds like on his jersey then. And then we have Neymar written in large letters on his back, right? So, and there's like folds and stuff. So N, Neymar Jr. Brazilian green letters. Okay, and they're kind of they can be bumpy, you know, because they're on his, the fabric of his jersey. So E. This one is on a fold now. Goes up and then kind of disappears behind the fold and then back up and then disappears. Kind of this way. And then the A. So the fold like here, Neymar. Junior then, so going around his back. Okay, so I think that's the best I can do for that. That is how to draw Neymar Jr. Looking to the side. Hope was helpful, guys. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye.